So on screen right now, you should be able to see what my Instagram app looks like. I cannot show you directly from my phone because I'm using my phone right now to record this video, but this is like a screen recording that I made to show you what my Instagram looks like. Basically, it, this has disabled completely the main feed, the explore feed, the stories, the reels, and I think some other stuff. Um, I can still access DMs, I can, I can send people messages, I can see my own profile, I can see other people's profiles, I can look for new profiles, follow and follow, I can post stories um, and normal posts, but basically like other people's stories, um, the feed, the explore feed, all of that is gone. You can still see stories from other people like from the DMs, if you're talking with them you'll see the circle there and you can click on it and see their story, or if you go to your own profile and then you go to the people you follow. From there, if you access their profile, then you can go to their profile and see their, their story, whatever. But, um, but basically, it disables the most toxic things um, because for me personally, I found that I was wasting so much time on the explore page, especially, because I would go there um, and I would just click on a random video and then start using Instagram as, as if it was TikTok. I, I've never had TikTok. But basically, Instagram nowadays feels like it's basically the same toxic thing. And I used to waste, I would say, I, I'm not happy to admit this, I'm kind of embarrassed, but I would say like a good hour every single day, like just watching dumb videos on Instagram. And, and it's actually fantastic that I found this solution because on the same day that I changed my whole Instagram thing and I didn't have it anymore, the day I came back, so usually the problem that I had is that I would come back from the gym, I would be so exhausted and I would just lay on the bed and start watching reels or whatever. But the same day that I fixed it, I came back from the gym, I went to open my phone, but I was like, I cannot do anything with Instagram right now. Like I can only, it's like WhatsApp or any other messaging app, like I can only send text. So there's nothing to do on my phone anymore. And I loved it so much because the, the instinctually what I, went to do is I actually picked up my Kindle and I started reading a book. And the, I, I, I love that so much. The fact that, okay, now I don't have any impulses to, towards distractions. And naturally the first thing that came to me was to start reading. And this is probably the reason why you want the solution to, right? Because you're wasting time on this thing that you consider to be like stupid. So now you have this thing to, to get back your attention. So what it is basically, I'm, I'm rambling so much. Um, basically, it's a custom APK. Um, it's a guy who made it. I've been talking with him for the last few days. So basically what he did was he downloaded the official Instagram app, he decompiled it with some tools, and then he went into the code and modified the code to basically disable all these toxic things. So like the main feed, explore, reels, stories, and I think a few other things. Um, and then he put the app back together and now you can download it as like, quote unquote, the official Instagram app, um, but without these toxic, toxic features, right? Um, it's 100% safe. Okay, don't worry about it. And, and basically the way, you, the, the way you can install it is you have to uninstall the Instagram app, the, the one you downloaded from the Play Store, the official one. And then you go to the link that I put in the description, you download that one, and install it and that's basically it then you go in you do the login and there you go he added a custom menu on the settings so once you install it you can go to the settings and if you want to enable something specific you can do that so say for example that for some reason you still want to see the story so not the main feed not the explore page but you still want to see stories you can do that so you can customize it a little bit um, say for example, that you only want to disable like the reels and the explore page, but you want to keep the main feed and the stories, you can do that, whatever, very easy. So one thing that he asked me though, um, is that if any of you watching this video know how to code and you guys are programmers and have experience coding for Android, he asked me if you can reach out to him to help him to basically maintain the app um, Instagram is constantly coming up with updates and it's hard for him to basically maintain the app by himself. So if he could have like some people helping and basically keeping the code up to date, that would be really nice. So when you go to the link in the description um, to his website from where you download the APK, there's also an email that you can reach out to him and offer help if you know, if you have experience coding. So. That's basically it. Um, I hope this was helpful and 
I'll see you on the next video. Peace.